What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Field Mouse, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is the sound of a cold beer cracking open after a long day at work. It has been a long week, and it's not over for me. I got to work the weekend, which sucks balls. Uh, but I figured I'd get some videos up for y'all. Uh, you know, it's no secret, I'm really enjoying Titanfall. It's a killer game in my opinion. Uh, you know, whoever disagrees with me can suck me. Uh, it does have its, you know, few downfalls, but that's cool. Every game has its downfalls. Even the infamous Call of Duty has its downfalls. So, uh, that's no biggie. Uh, every game has something that someone doesn't like. So, uh, you know, that's nothing new. There, There's never a perfect game that's you know out and you know people just have to play it and it's you know perfection pretty much uh, but yeah I got a few things I want to talk about today I uh, got a pretty long video it's a game of attrition uh, can't remember the map I'm not I've said it before I'm not very good with remembering the map names on this one except for you know like a select few uh, which are probably like my favorite map so you know uh, but I have a pretty good gameplay in, or which I thought I was doing good, and uh, score-wise and game-wise, overall, I did really well. I only died four times, which a couple of them were stupid, and they were my fault. Uh, and at the end of it, I pulled up the little scoreboard, and I realized that it was like me and two other dudes versus like five or six more pilots. And, you know, I was like, well, no, no fucking wonder we're getting beat. It's, you know, five or six on three. And the other two guys just weren't doing anything, weren't helping me out in the least bit. So I pretty much carried the team. We lost, but it was a pretty good game on my part. But I do have a couple things I don't want to discuss. Uh, one is the satchel charge, which is pretty much C4. Uh, you know, it's... It's real similar to C4. I, I mean, in my opinion, it's pretty much the same damn thing. Uh, you you toss this little pack out, and then you remote detonate it. So, pretty much the same thing as C4. And when you come up to a group of pilots or specters, instinct is to, you know, fire your gun, waste your bullets, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, some situations we can't, you know, get away from that. So that's cool but uh, my tip for you guys and see right here right here I cannot ever see when the pilots are on top of my damn Titan because like they're laying down like dry humping it and I, I literally can't ever see them when I get out and somebody's like rodeo rodeoing whoa rodeoing my pop my Titan excuse me uh, hold on uh, all right, there we go. There we go. I can't never see it. Like, I seriously, they look like part of the damn Titan, in my opinion. But the tip I have for you on the satchel charges is don't waste your bullets. Don't Just save your ammo because, you know, you need that ammo for, you know, gunfights with pilots. You know, it's more crucial to a gunfight with a pilot than it is a grunt or something. You can go up to a group of grunts and like donkey kick them all in the face and get away with it uh, so my my tactic is put satchel charges on and when you run into a group of specters or grunts throw a satchel charge out it'll kill nearly every one of them if they're still grouped up pretty tightly so that's my tip for y'all uh, me personally it works great for me you don't really like right here's a perfect example Boom, I started shooting and I was like, shit, I got satchel charges. Killed four grunts with one satchel charge. So, you know, and chances are, I've noticed a lot of the times that pilots will like kind of camp out by grunts and specters because they run up to it. They think that you're one of them if your little name don't pop up or whatever. So they just run up to you and, dude, surprise the hell out of them. Just be chilling, you know, and when you toss that satchel charge, they'll never expect it coming. They'll expect it, you know, like, never. <laughs> like, it surprises them every time. So uh, that's a pretty good tip. 
Uh, another one is the ability, the uh, stem ability. Uh, health regen faster, and then uh, your movement uh, speed or whatever uh, increases for you know the period of time that it allows you. And that is good on many levels. First off, it regenerates your health for excuse me that period of time and if you're getting shot in the back while you're you know uh, uh, running away or going around a corner or some shit like that hit that little stem button and you will like most of the time I mean I'm not saying you'll get out of it every single time but a lot of the times it will get you out of it because you're moving so much faster than everybody else and you know it'll allow you to get away from those you know bullets and gunshots that's being fired your way so you know that's another helpful tip I know a lot of people like the whole cloaking thing and don't get me wrong the cloaking thing is cool as hell I love it but I don't use it that much because you're not really invisible I mean everybody knows that you can still see like the silhouette of the person so it's you know I don't know if it's pretty much a useless ability but I mean it does help because sometimes you you know you won't see somebody but for the most part most of the time people see it uh, another thing I want to talk about is what I'm doing right here the whole wall hanging thing I myself have gotten tricked so many times like I can't count on all four of my limbs how many times I've been you know running this dude down gunning him down whatever you want to call it he runs into a building I run into the building and like I'm like where the fuck did he go where did he go and I'm just like sitting there looking like a dumbass looking because I have no clue where he went and homie will be hanging on the wall above me and he'll watch me run in and he'll jump down and kill me it is a spectacular thing uh... my opinion that is a absolute like cool ass idea to put in a game and like i said it will really fake some people out like you can get some kills off of it and i've you know after it happened to me a, a number of times I've tried it and it does get you kills like because people don't expect it most people who are playing Titanfall right now are used to Call of Duty and uh, you know Battlefield a lot of people still play Halo me myself I do not uh, but you know most people who are playing this game are you know big Call of Duty players big Battlefield players and that's never been a part of you know Call of Duty or Battlefield you can't double jump you can't wall hang you can't you know wall run things like that so people don't expect it and it's it's just a super good tactic like I, I absolutely love it the only bad part of it the only downfall is you can't aim down the sights which is cool you know I mean obviously you can't wall hang and aim down your sights which you know I don't know it, it's a cool tactic uh, I like it I use it mostly just to get you know out of the way you know quickly instead of actually trying to you know kill the enemy because you can only hit fire and if you've played this game hit firing really isn't that good on this game it, it really isn't uh, it takes a whole lot to kill somebody hit firing so uh, another tip I have the whole ice pick uh, tier uh, what tier is it I think it's tier 2 maybe uh, correct me if I'm wrong might be tier 2 tier 1 uh, we but we all know that it's one of the two tiers <laughs> but the ice pick that thing helps tremendously I, I when I unlocked it I was like man this is stupid as hell and then I started hacking them turrets and it takes like no time it it goes like a snap of a finger and you got it hacked already so that's pretty badass I really like it um but anyways I'm gonna bring y'all guys some more videos uh, I got some more gameplay already ready to go just gotta do a commentary on it uh, let me know if you're enjoying my Titanfall videos as much as I am because I am telling y'all and everybody already knows
I love Titanfall. Can't get enough of it. I hope they keep going with the series. It's a badass game. I love it. So uh, let me know what you think. Let me know if uh, you like any of the things that I talked about tonight. The uh, wall hanging, the stem, the satchel chars. Tell me your opinions on it. Uh, but anyways, guys, I will catch y'all on my next video. And y'all just be patient. I'll bring some more videos y'all's way. Peace. the garage, eh?